for groceries, food. Even school supplies could get a little easier for some families under Governor Walker's proposed child tax credit. For a lot of families who face challenges in terms of making ends meet, this will be a compelling way uh, for them to have access to some dollars to support their families. Regardless of your income, if you are a state resident with children under the age of 18 who live at home, you would qualify for a $100 tax credit per child. Walker says the state has a surplus in the budget that he wants to pass along to families. How did you end up with more money in the budget? Well, it's a combination of uh, sales tax revenues are up because the economy is going well. Expenditures by the state have, have been lower than originally anticipated. Walker presented the idea during his State of the State speech. Some Democrats, though, say they have pushed for this plan in the past. I think we heard a really good campaign speech. Um, very candidly, we heard a lot of things that Democrats have been pushing for, um, whether it is the child tax credit, whether it is rural schools and funding those. It doesn't matter what I said at the podium yesterday. They would say this is an election year. There's some better way. If lawmakers approve the plan, eligible families would be able to sign up online at a website that will be announced at a later date. Reporting from the Web Center, I'm Sheldon Dutas, WISN 12 News. Governor Walker says the child tax credit would be permanent this year. Families would receive a check by September 1st. Next year, it would be part of income taxes. Some